Where do I go when there's no one to turn to? Feel all alone wondering why. Where do I go when I need familiar? Woman, hold my hand. Woman, hold my hand. Who do I turn to when my legs get shaky? Eyes cloud over, I can't see my way. Who lets me know that I'm still walking upright? Woman, hold my hand. Woman, hold my hand. This song is called May Francis, and I sent it to my sister when uh, she was in her last month in this space we are sharing. And she had called me to tell me that she wanted to talk to me about dying and was it all right? Because she believed in God and she thought that God did miracles, but she had a feeling that she could no longer express May Francis through her body and it was tired. And uh, she wanted to talk to me about maybe it was okay to die. And you know, I'm, I'm really radical, so anytime I get called, I, I just try to stand up to the plate. We had this conversation. After I hung up the phone, I thought, ah, she's getting me ready. She's trying to leave me. And I wrote this song that said, I don't care where you're going, you better stick your hand out here so I can hold on to it. You'd better not really, really leave me. Who binds my wounds when I'm bruised and battered by strangers and those daily walking in my life? Who knows that I am more than my hurtings? Woman, hold my hand. Who cries with me when I lose my baby by accident, choice, or against my will? Who knows that I am a childless mother? Woman, hold my hand. Woman, hold my hand. Who bids me sing when my voice is silent? Songs have left me for places unheard. Who bids me sing when all singing seems useless? Woman, hold my hand. Woman, hold my hand. And the song felt so needy to me, I didn't want to send it to her. But since I called it May Francis, I sent it to her. She called me and said, thank you. I was needing a hand to hold on to. And the miracle for me was out of my neediest neediestness, I reached out and found that my neediestness, which is not always a positive thing, matched what somebody else needed. And it was like a light, because I didn't know about that kind of reaching out. Because when you reach out and you're burdened and you're in trouble, you think you are weighing somebody down. And who's to know whether just reaching out and hooking on is balanced and reciprocal? And she did come to see me several times. We can